Hey guys, welcome to another video. Hasib here. Hope you all are doing well. This is another landing page review video. That's right. This is a Go High Level Junk Removal landing page that we recently created. And I'm going to talk about all the sections, all the columns, elements, um, conversion rate optimization principles, and mobile responsiveness about this page. So you guys can, if you want to buy it, obviously go to landingpages.myleadbuster.com and buy this page, Junk Removal 3, link in description. And if you want to create a similar page, you can just watch this video so I can talk about uh, what I've done in this page. And also you can follow the same to uh, create your own design. So let's start talking about the design. So let's start with the header. This is a logo and uh, as you can see the image is a custom val value here so all you need to do if you buy it of course all you need to do is just update the custom values and all the data will be populated and this is the phone number uh, obviously this is the desktop version we're going to look at the mobile des design separately this is the header and as you can see we've used some fancy uh, fonts here this is a good icon, uh, like a clip art, uh, which actually creates trust and indicates that they do a same day service. And uh, the call out headline is followed by a few bullet points because we always like to replace paragraphs with bullet points because it's easy to the eye. It's readable, uh, like the readability for bullet points is way, way better than paragraphs. So uh, it has a request a callback option, which takes you to the, uh, to the form so they can fill out the form for a callback or if they want to call directly they can do it from uh, by clicking the button here so uh, that's what it looks like on desktop that's what it looks like on mobile and this section obviously like any other page I create is uh, sticky to the bottom so uh, what I've done is I've created a section just for mobile I've hidden it on desktop as you can see on advanced it's not visible on desktop and in general uh, what I've done is I have made this option stick to bottom on scroll. So it won't be visible on desktop and it will be sticky on mobile browsing. So when you keep scrolling, it will be sticky to the bottom. And uh, going back to the desktop design. So this is another three column section. The left column having this headline and text and the, the middle column having this, this clip art and the, this uh, form will be filled out by those who need the service. The, the call to action is either call us or request a callback. That's pretty much it. And if they request a callback, this form submission takes them to the thank you page. Going to the next section, uh, we have this two column section over here. Uh, obviously this is what you can see an image and this is also another image. So you can create images like this on Canva. Obviously you have a free version on, uh, of Canva uh, that you can use to create a similar section like this. So just go to canva.com and create your own design. And if, obviously you can see these are some images. Obviously the images need to be authentic. They can't be any stock image because people don't like seeing stock images uh, when you're when they're actively looking for a service. This could be your company car and uh, these are some services they provide again th this is another call to action section this is a testimonial section obviously you need to uh, you know have your own testimonials in it and uh, followed by the section service areas so this is the map i always like creating maps from maps.ie slash create google map and uh, pasting that embed code that i generate from that website here because it allows me to have a more uh, navigatable you know map here in the page I don't quite like the go high level uh, map element that they have. All right, so this is the list. This is another list that you can use to show the areas that you provide service in and ending with the footer, which is a like basic footer headline, two buttons in the same column. So uh, a lot of you ask me how I do this. So this is one column really. I don't have two columns. And what I do is I go to column layout and select horizontal. If I do it vertical, it will be stacked on top of each other. So I'll just do horizontal. That's all I need to do really. So let's look at the actual design now. This is what it looks like on desktop. And uh, yeah, so the map is, map can be moved from here as you can see. And if you click on inspect, go to mobile design. Like I said, the call option is always sticky to the bottom. Um, and this is what it looks like on mobile pretty much. So again, if you want to buy it, go to the link in the description and you can buy it. I'll send you the snapshot with this page and the form and everything. You just need to update the custom values and that's it. Uh, but if you want to build a similar design, uh, you can do that by following the, the layout that I used on this one. Obviously, you have to keep pausing the video and then, you know, keep creating your own version of the landing page for junk removal. So that's it for this one. And I will see you in the next one.